All right, guys, walk it in. Make sure ball's in both goals. That's all right, come on, jog it in, guys. So we can get it started. Come, bird up. All right, guys, and the game against Newcastle, um, on the weekend, we struggled to play out under pressure. We ended up a lot of times with a long ball, mainly to the nines. They had 2v1 against us there. We lost the ball, and we didn't really get into the game that way. So today, the session objective is, can we, get, uh, can we play out mainly with the three and four and try to get the team better in ability to play out under pressure of the red team in this case, so you replicate Newcastle Jets. Um, and I'll tell you how to, I like you to position to make sure the match is realistic or the, the training is realistic to the match. Um, so we're going to, if you look at the whiteboard here, so we're the Blues. So we play with the back four, Blair Goals, Eli Santino, uh, Burden uh, left, and Finn on the right, two holding midfielders, and we have a 7 11. I took the 9 and the 10 out because I don't want you to end up with long balls today again. So. I want you to try and find a different solution and I'll give you some t a team tasks. So a team task today is can we play out under pressure and then without using always the long ball, all right? And that's why we're going to play. All right, there we go. Start getting positions. All right, the Reds in position, so Ruben, yes, start of the nine. Chapel, you'll be a right winger. So I want you to start higher. Red will play with two tens. Darcy as a left winger. Ruben in beginning. All right, there we go, start to play. Right, that'd be that'd be a free kick in the game. Yeah, start with the goalkeeper. Yep. All right, here, start here, play it here.
All right, ball start there. Blair. Okay, Blair, hold the ball for me. Red, I want you to press in this way like it was in the match. So, yeah, Ruben, you'll be in between. Uh, Josh, yes, yeah, stay in between the right. Make sure you cover him. When Red, and in this case, Darcy, 7, 11, or 9, maybe even a 10 at times. When you think there's a realistic chance to press and win the ball is when you do it. I just want your starting position like that. That's in the game. All right, you can go a bit higher because they wasn't looking to cover our 7 or 11. Okay, so start a bit higher. And I want that. Yep, play. All right, hold it there, stop there. Perfect. Go to your starting positions, red as well, blue, starting positions. All right, for the team task, can we get one of the back four? Can we try to create an overload in midfield? My team task for us in the back four, can we create an overload in midfield? And particularly my three and four. So if you get a 2v1 out wide, I want to see that. Or something else. Can we create an overload in the back in the midfield? Show me if you can do it. Yes, play. Well done, well done. Well played. All right, ball here with blip. Ball with blip. Push up, Red. Red, think about your team task. Try to press when you think it's realistic to win the ball. All right, for my, hold the ball there. For my center backs. Ball back to Blair. For my center backs, three and four. We're trying to create a 2 v one Yes, so how can we play 2 v one Can you get in the area? where Ruben, in this case, the number nine, cannot press you at the same time. So yes, if that's what your answer is, think about it. For my, three, my five and two, can you get in a starting position to receive the ball and with your first part or ball face forward and try to pass it forward? Always try to pass it forward if possible. 
I like you to do, do that. Yes, please. Well done. Not too high, Finn, not too high. Stay in touch with your fullback. Well played, well done. Yes, Berlin, face forward, well done. Play multi, play for you, yep. All right, ball back here. Think about the back four. Think about back four. About your positioning and the team task. Create an overload in midfield. Play. All right, ball back here with Flip. Red, reinforce. Josh, make sure you're not get caught out too high. Red, get in your pressing positions. So right winger, striker, left winger. Not too high, make it realistic like it was in the game. Burden, don't get too high. It needs to be what the problem was in the game. Play. All right, stop it there. Ball back over here. Stop it there. Ball back here. Perfect. So for my three and four, with your goalkeeper, can you create a 2v1 over here or a 3v1? This is what you're creating. Can one of you now, if we see the picture, drive into midfield? Ideally, 
opposite of the nine. So not too close where the nine can press. Six and eight. Can you support the three and the four if they receive pressure to be an outlet? There's a few options. Think about which ones you want. So start with Blair. Think about can we get the three and four or the two and five, but ideally three and four in this case, drive into midfield. There we play. Well done, Dom. Well done. That's a brilliant. Well played. Throw in there. Well done, Dom. That's a brilliant idea. Throw in there. Flip. Yeah, use the goalkeeper, yes, restart. Brilliant. Yes. There you go. Yes, Ruben, try to press. Think about it. Well done. Ball back with Blair. Blair start. Ruben changed with Chapel. So be winger to so have a little bit less. Josh plays at nine. Well done. Try red. Try to press a bit more burden. Don't start too high. Because you, you'll say to the right fullback to come and press you. Give your give your can you get in a position to give Satino an option earlier? Yes. Play. All right, hold it there. Perfect for my six and eight. If we can recreate this. So we see a 2v1 against the nine. In this case, Ruben comes in a bit. Where can, can you position yourself somewhere to create more, a lot more space for the three and four to drive in? So can you create? That's up to you. I want to see how we can do it, solve it ourselves. So can we get in an area where we you and one of the three and the four get more space to play in midfield in the overlap? Start with Blair. There we go. So they're creating an overload in midfield, ideally. Well done, Red. Well done. Start again, Blair. Can you get? Think about. Can you get an area to receive the ball? Yes. Can we first touch face forward.
Yes, Eli, well done. Unlucky, well done. That's the option. Yes, please. Under pressure, think about where your outlets are, where your outlets. Well done. Yes. Well done, well done. Well done, Centino. Good positioning. All right, reset. Yes. Well done. Darcy, think about it. Where's your play? Yes. Oh. All right, stop it here. Ball back over here. Well done, I'll let you finish the attack. Finn, you have the ball here. Eli, you're over there in good position. So the three and four, yeah, when he gets pressure, can you get an area to be an outlet? So good positioning there. So you get pressure, Darcy over here. My midfield is six and eight. When you see a two or five gets pressed by the strikers or the winger in this case, can you be an option for the two and five to play off? That's the one. The seven and 11, yes, the seven was positioned right here. Think about what your options are. If we go forward straight away, 1v1, perfect, but he faces the goal. So we need to move the ball quick. Can we all, for all players, you're playing tasks. Move for a high ball speed to move all them out of a position to attack in those areas. There we go, go back. Play, yep. Good, think about your starting position, six and eight. Yes, Dom. Great ball. Blair, one more hit. So we blip. So red, push up higher. Ruben, yeah. Burden, drop a bit deeper. Yes, put. Think about creating an overload in midfield first. Well done, Eli, great. Good looking forward, good run, Rizzi. Good ball speed, trying to grade forward. All right, restart. Good. Try to press, Rip, try to press. Think about your starting position, Cal, yes. Dom, think about it. One more here, one more here. Mosey, kick a ball here. One more with. So, red, yeah. Push up. 
Zach, start out wide. Think about the 10 and 11 and 9. Normally be there. Good, Josh. Josh, try to press them too. Yep. One more ball here, Blair. Last one. Yes, job, do a good job. Hard work, I know. Blair, burden, not too high. Think about your starting positions. Free kick, free kick, take it. Good, well done. Well, you're tired, you're too tired. Overload in midfield. Your cues. When the nine's pressing, your cues. Well done. Good job, Blair. Quick restart. All right, walk it in, guys. Quickly jog it in. Zaki. All right, good job, guys. I know for the red, it's sometimes it's hard work, especially if blue plays that well. So this is where we had the trouble with because at times we were not brave enough to play those shorter passes in midfield. So we all have player tasks. There's a team task. Can we create an overload? Ideally, this first overload can we create is a three and four with a nine. If they receive pressure, can the two and five support the, the three and the four? Ideally in a wider eight with the first touch facing forward. If that and then if they receive it or if there's trouble can the six and eight if the three and the four get pressure can they be an outlier like what dom did eli brought the ball in he got pressure from the nine there was no out outlet on the right way a uh, right fullback he came in and bounced it off to the three or to the four sorry and he dribbled in and created two for on the left perfect that's what i want to recreate and then it goes further and further with the freedom of 7 and 11 coming inside and if they're 10, what happens at time um, in the Newcastle game, if they're 10 presses are also one of ours, yes, our midfielders need to maybe start a little bit higher to create that space for yourself and for the three four to drive in that area. So good job, guys. Well done. And uh, we're going to continue on this working much more because I think there's a lot of benefit we can get out of it. All right, guys. Thank you.